Today we're gonna to do a video on how to do a vinyl wrap on a cornhole board. We got one completed. Now we're gonna do the second one. So I got these vinyl wraps from Amazon. First thing we do is to make sure that it's clean underneath. What I did here is I uh, I put a coat of varnish on my plywood here. That way it has something to, to adhere to. So you line up your vinyl. So it's a 24 by 48. So the vinyl wraps are a little bit, a little bit, like maybe a quarter of an inch, eighth of an inch overlap. So make sure it's right. Nice. Great guys. I'm gonna tape it. You need any kind of tape, not the tape. Double check. Make sure it's nice. Overlap on each side. <clears throat> okay, then what I do here is once it's on nice and straight, you peel back the line, uh peel back the back end okay. of the line on here. So we're gonna pull back like four inches on it. Be careful with this. You don't want to wrinkle it. I did one and I messed it up last year. I couldn't use it. Just be real careful with this. So what we do here is, I don't know, it's about four or five inches. Then just cut off your backing on it. Get rid of that. Then you put on your vinyl. Like so. And what I got here is my squeegee I'm using here. Is I got this from uh, Harbor Freight. It's a paint trimmer. Just a, I'm using this as my squeegee. You can use a squeegee, but I like this because it's like six inches. So then what I do here, then I take off my tape, my hand here. Take off the tape on both sides. Now that it's lined up, then I roll back my vinyl. Real careful with this. Now what I do here is I peel back the back end okay. on my squeegee. I just hit it here and go straight with it. Now be real careful with it, guys. Go straight down the middle. And as you go on, you hit the sides here. You, could, you don't want to get any air bubbles in here. So, that's why you got me in my wide squeegee here. So, okay, now we're going to trim off the edge here. See how it's overlapped like a, I would say it's a sixteenth of an inch. If you're good with a utility blade, utility knife, I like to use these uh, cut off blades. And I just start here on top. You can use a straight edge, put it on here and cut down, but this is stay right nice and firm next to your wood. And just go straight down, just like that, guys. Just like that. See how we're doing that? Make sure the blade is sharp. Let's do six inch hole. Press down, look for your hole. So I got me another blade I'm gonna use. You can break off the blade, but I just got another one here. So make sure it's nice and sharp. And the same, find where it is, press, and just, just hug your edges. Just hug your edges. Like so, see that? 
Sure, move that one. Okay, that's down on the edge here. All the corners, make sure you hit down on it. Okay, so what we're gonna do now is gonna go ahead and brush coat of varnish on top of here. Put a nice coat of varnish on here. Well, I got my bag from Amazon also. There it is there, guys. That's how you do a wrap. Very simple. Thank you for watching my tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe and like.